Hello YouTube, hope everyone is doing well today. It's Jalen and Maria back with another video. In this week's video, we'll be telling you our top four favorite French Netflix series that we've watched over the years. Most of them we watched in college. They did help us with their language skills because, you know, watching TV is a great way to improve your French or any other foreign language that you're learning. We have an article about that on the blog that we'll link below. Make sure to check that out. But they're also just fun to watch. It's a good time. You can relax and learn. Yeah, yeah, totally. Um, like she said, we do have an article about this and I would invite everyone to check out our website that goes along with our YouTube channel and follow us on social media as well. Without further ado, I guess we'll jump right into it. Okay, so our first show that we have is a show called Engrenage. The English title for the show is Spiral. Um, basically, the show follows six different people that are in the Parisian judicial system and you know that it's it's a crime show so there's you know murders and stuff that they're trying to figure out but there's also a lot of corruption that is followed throughout the show so you have these six people who are in the judicial system but also find themselves tangled in quite a few personal matters personal matters yeah personal matters and um even crime themselves it's a crime show that doesn't necessarily focus on the crimes and the detective work itself but more of the judicial system this show is very good and out of five stars i would definitely give it a solid three um it's exciting in some parts, but sometimes it can be a little slow, I guess. But there are a lot of seasons, which is definitely a plus for shows in my opinion. I like to binge watch things, and there's seven seasons of this show. I haven't seen all seven seasons. I think there were two or three on Netflix last time I was watching the show, but it, there could definitely be more. I'll be leaving a link in the description of all the shows that we mentioned, so you can check them out, see where they're streaming in your country, and yeah. So our second show on our list is called Les Témoins, or Witnesses in English. It has two seasons, um, and it's again another police crime show. It takes place in the north of France, and the basic premise is that some graves have been dug up, and the perpetrators have clearly created a theme for the detectives to figure out. Yeah. And I think it's good that it's set in the north of France because the north of France is a very like uh, rainy mm -hmm. and kind of cold region of the country. So it really adds to the theme that the show is following. Like crimes that are committed in the show are really strange. It's two detectives, one retired one who recently came back into the force um, and a kind of new detective who worked together to try and solve these crimes. There's plenty of crime shows in France and abroad. So if you're into that, then you would probably like Damon. We both really liked this series. It was really easy to turn it on and get lost in it. Mm -hmm. It was pretty complicated and fun to follow, so we gave it a four out of five. Yes. So the third show on our list is called Les Revenants, or The Returned in English. And again, it's sort of a mystery crime show. Uh, it takes place in small town France, and the basic idea is that people from all different walks of life come back to life after seemingly having been dead and the show kind of pieces together how that can be and also follows the recently returned to life people and how they're sort of picking up their lives again. Obviously you can see what kind of shows we like. <laughs> this show follows that same pattern. Uh, it takes place a lot in wooded areas. It's very cloudy so if you like that kind of thing again you would probably like this show. The English title as we said is The Returned but in America there is a show called The Returned, and it's based on the French Les Revenants, Les Revenants which was broadcasted internationally with the title The Returned. So you may have seen this show basically already, but with different actors and probably uh, a slightly story. different story. But um, there are two The Returned, but only one of them is Les Revenants. Also, our Revenants has two seasons. Yes, the mm -hmm. one that we're talking about, the French one has two seasons, and uh, we definitely liked it a lot, so we gave it a slightly higher rating of 4.25, not just four. All right, for our last Netflix series, we have a show that is called 
that means 10%. That is not the English title for the show though. It's actually called Call My Agent. Um, this show is hilarious and I, I just love it honestly, but it has three seasons and it basically is following the lives of these agents who are agents for really big movie stars and they follow their personal lives and their professional lives while they try to keep these huge stars happy and while they try to keep the business afloat because there's a lot of stuff going on in the agency which is called ASK. It's really funny, there's like little love affairs and uh, arguments and things like that so I rated this show a 4.5 out of 5 only because I guess no show is perfect. I would have given it a 5 out of 5 honestly because I like it. So there you have it. Those are the four shows that we recommend and that we liked a lot on Netflix um, for people who are learning French or who understand French. Even if you don't understand French, they're good shows. Yeah, honestly. Watch them with subtitles. That is a good point, yes. <laughs> Even if you don't understand French, these are good shows that you can easily watch with um, subtitles. I'm not sure if all the shows come with subtitles, but you know, Netflix is pretty good about subtitles, especially for people who are watching from America. So if you're watching from America, then you're probably good to go. These are good shows, I'm telling you, so watch them. Thank you for watching our video. Please consider subscribing to the channel if you like this type of video because we will be doing more like this. And check out our other videos as well because we also do vlogging and things like that. Make sure that you look in the description box below or at the bottom of the screen right here so that uh, you can follow us on social media, Instagram, Twitter, and our website. Leave a comment below based on which one you want to check out, which series you're going to watch, or if you've already seen any of them. Yes. And if you know. have any suggestions for what we should watch next, mm -hmm. let us know that too. Yeah. And uh, yeah, so that's all we have for you today, and we will see you next time. Bye. Bye.